here. Across several states. Yvette Simpson, when you look at this now from the perspective of Friday rather than Tuesday night, it turns out that the Africa and Atlanta in Las Vegas all did come out for Joe Biden. They did. And I do want to say that that was not without a lot of work. You know, we're talking a lot about Stacey Abrams and her work over the last decade in Georgia, also lots of organizing um, efforts from organizations like Black Voters Matter across all these states, um, Black Male Voter Project. Now, there are a lot of organizations that are black focused who've been doing this work through a pandemic to get people to come out. And they came out overwhelmingly. And I, I love that. And I'm excited that we're talking about that. I think the real question is, what does that look like now? How do we continue to serve those people? Ram and I have been talking about you know, the real importance of delivering for black voters in this moment who really showed up against all odds. And if you think about it, it's not that surprising, right? One, you know, African Americans are deeply, deeply impacted uh, by this pandemic. The racial unrest that's happening, the war that Trump has caused, uh, siding with uh, white supremacists, emboldening white supremacists has really motivated African American voters. And also that good old organizing that still works in communities, bringing out new voters. It's not just shifting de demographics. It's expanding the electorate and going to places where we don't traditionally invest resources and getting those folks engaged and bringing them uh, into the fold. And I, I just want to say great effort in all of these cities. Uh, and I'm glad that we had this result. So 